The government's leading COVID advisor, Yun Kwok Yong, called on Hong Kongers to spend the holiday season at home and avoid gatherings. He also pointed out the pitfalls of take-home COVID tests, which could lead to false negative results. It's been two weeks since Hong Kong experienced a fourth wave of the COVID outbreak, with authorities forced to roll back lockdown measures. However, infectious disease expert and government advisor Yun Kwok Yong suggested the infection spike could have been prevented. Yun attributed the latest rebound to loopholes at the border, allowing imported cases to penetrate the community. He gave the example of conveyor belt workers at the airport, pointing out the coronavirus can linger on their gloves and contaminate luggage. And with people letting their guard down over the past month or so, banquets, social dancing or even staycations at hotels eventually led to the current outbreak. The pressing task for the government, he said, is to properly screen arrivals at the border, including overseas students returning home for the holidays. Yun also called on everyone to stay put and enjoy a quiet Christmas devoid of gatherings. He said the fourth wave can be tamed as long as authorities were willing to get tough on social distancing regulations. The expert also asked the government to pay attention to the accuracy of COVID tests administered by private firms. He warned a false negative result may occur if the client does not leave a sufficient amount of saliva. This came as machines distributing spit test kits will be set up from tomorrow at 10 MTR stations, including North Point, Two King Lin, Tai Wai and Tai Po Market. About 1,000 testing kits will be dished out every day through each machine. And citizens have to return their saliva specimen to government-designated clinics.